All right, April 30th is Adopt a Shelter Pet Day. If you're considering bringing a furry friend into your home, we're helping you get a head start on this big transition. Richard and Vicki Horowitz of Barkbusters are here, along with a four year old shelter rescue, Bruce Wayne. He's an American Stafford Terrier. Yes, he is. We're trying to be a little bit calm to keep Bruce calm. Yeah. Right? <laughs> yes. He's got a ton of energy. He's got an amazing amount of energy for a four year old dog. Now, this is a topic that's close to my heart because I um, adopted a shelter puppy, Lucy, who's my little daughter. We're going to show a picture, I think. And I think there are a lot of myths around shelter dogs. You know, you hear people say, oh, watch out. You don't know what you're going to get. When in reality, I think there are, you know, the majority of dogs out there. Are loving dogs that just want a good home. They really yeah. are. And not everybody can get a shelter dog. Mm -hmm. A lot of the rescue agencies come in and interview the family to make yeah. sure They're it's getting, an appropriate household. Yeah. They're getting um, more stringent in their rules. They don't want these dogs to come back because every right. time a dog is returned, it's more traumatic again for that dog um, to get adjusted into a new home. So it, it's important that you know what you're, you're getting into and just know that dogs are creatures of habit mm -hmm. and they really need leadership. Right. And if you can show them that you're the leader of your house and you put rules in place and you're the pack leader, and that means any adults in the household, the dogs tend to settle and fall into place in your household. And yeah. then they become really happy pets. And that's what we want. Yeah. You, you guys always give such wonderful advice. What Thank should you. folks do Thank to you. prepare their family okay. and their home? So you may want to have a, a meeting or the family uh, and plan things out. Who's going to take care of the dog? Um, you know, who's going to uh, feed the dog? Who's going to walk the dog? Have all that preparation in place prior to bringing home a dog. And other rules including things like where do you want the dog to sleep and things like that mm -hmm. because then you don't have issues when the dog comes home. Also make sure you have the appropriate uh, supplies for your dog, a food bowl, a leash, a collar, things like that. People don't think about that. Um, many dogs like to den themselves, so you may want to have a crate, and yeah. there's nothing wrong with using a crate. We've talked about this before. In yes. fact, my dog seems to like her crate. She doesn't yeah. like the door shut. Okay. She likes it open, and she likes the door to the mudroom shut. Okay. She's very particular. Yeah. Yeah. But it works for her, and even at five, she goes in there yeah. and is happy. Yeah. 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 One of the things that people don't realize is that dogs need a time to adjust into their new environment. Mm -hmm. And so people really should try to consider being home for a uh, number of days after they bring a yeah, pet home. Right. You know, people who bring their dog home and then they go off to work the next day, the dogs develop separation anxiety, they can become disruptive because they're not settled and they don't feel safe and secure in that environment. And so between that and sometimes you'll see housebreaking accidents as they adjust to a new home, people just have to be prepared that that's normal for dogs to go through those types of things. Is that more important for a dog from the shelter or just as important from a dog from wherever? Wherever. Wherever. Okay. wherever. And when you bring a shelter dog home, walk them around the house, walk them outside first, on leash around the neighborhoods so they get used to it, then bring them in the house, walk them around the house in the rooms that he's gonna, he or she's going to be permitted in. Um, but also confine them a little bit until yeah. they get used yeah. to the house. And if there's other pets in the house, you want to introduce them on leash and get them used right. to it slowly and you, want, you don't want it to be overwhelming. And another really big thing is people like, oh, I have a new dog, let's have people over. Yeah. You really have to give our dogs mm -hmm. a chance to adjust before you start having a lot of visitors come to the house because that just causes more stress and our dogs may misbehave. The shelter even that. told me to give it a few days before I gave her a bath just to have her get right. ready yes. and with yeah. the home before I did anything new. Um, real quick, just tell us about Bruce Wayne. Has he found a home? Oh, he has a wonderful, wonderful home. home. Okay, great. His owner is fabulous. He did great, didn't he? He really yes, did. Yes, he did. Well, yeah, thank you, you two. You always you. Uh, are such great guests. We appreciate thank it. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you.